I just want you guys to take everything I said in this video and just put it in your brain. And if you skip through this video a little bit, I don't care if it was 15 seconds, go rewatch it. So, I am actually about to go hit the gym right now. I've been in the past couple of hours, I've been doing homework, and while I'm doing homework, I've been cooking meals, um, prepping food for the next couple of days, just to get it out of the way. You know, when I sit here and do homework, um, I've been wanting to, you know, cook meals and such as well uh, while I'm doing that just because, you know, it's good on my time since I've been so busy lately. I haven't really slept in the past, like, you know, five days, so it's it's been crazy. So while I'm doing my homework, while I'm editing videos, while I'm doing this and that, I'm over here cooking, like, I just cooked some rice up. I'm going to cook some more when I come back from the gym. But it's actually around 9 o'clock right now. So I'm going to go to the gym and um, go train some arms. And I'll come back. Start to talk to you guys, um, make my post workout. I mean, I ate about an hour ago too, and just get the grind going and try to finish it off the rest of this day. So I've just been so packed the past couple of days. Like I said, I haven't slept in like you know around five days. It's been a uh, pretty pretty hectic, pretty crazy. I've been doing so much and traveling. Um, I went to Atlanta, and it's just been insane. And I haven't really had time to do much. So this is like the best for me. And um, I've been prepping videos, you know, the day before, the day before that. So it's just, it's just been a little crazy. Just got back from the gym. It's around, I think, 11.30. Had a great workout. Still yet to make this video for you guys tomorrow. So if you guys are watching this around 11 o'clock, just know that I was probably up till 3 in the morning making this video and everything. Because I got a lot to do today. The day is just starting um, I know that sounds horrible, but I really do got a lot to do and uh, you know, I'm not just gonna push it off So just got back from the gym made myself shake and uh, now I want to talk to you guys about a few things So let's head over to the table. So guys, I want to harp on something that It kind of hit me yesterday. I've been loving the positivity in the comment section. I think it's great I think positivity is the number one thing that I love promoting because it's so easy to be negative. It's so easy to be negative and seeing all you guys be positive in the comment section is truly showing me that in some type of way, not only me, but someone out there is inspiring you to be more positive and uh, spread goodness throughout the world. I think that's absolutely amazing. I think this is going to be one of the most valuable videos I've ever posted on YouTube. And I'm gonna state that right now. And I just want you guys to watch this all the way through, take in everything that I'm saying, and you know, get your keep, get your little notepads out, start. Nah. So I've been wanting to talk for a minute, and I got a little YouTube comment yesterday. Let me, let me pull this bad boy up. Ooh, that boy, that, this thing long. All right. <clears throat> this is from Bryce. Props to you, my man. Honestly, I have a quick question for you. I'm a student at the College of Charleston, and I have been making the two-hour drive home almost every weekend to Columbia to fish my home lake. Between school, work, applying for grad school, and fishing, I feel your struggle with the grind so that you can accomplish what you want. I wanted to ask you what you do for those sleepless nights when you have a lot of schoolwork to keep you up and going. I'm on the coffee grind, but wanted to see if you have any alternatives. Awesome, like, like that was an awesome comment right there. Don't turn this off, I want you guys to hear this. <clears throat> so he was saying, you know, he's grinding too, he's getting all his work done, he's really putting forth the effort, he's wanting to be the best, he's putting in the work, you know, I think that is awesome. I think that is great, dude. Uh, Bryce, seriously, man. I think that is awesome that you're putting in the work. And I understand, dude. I understand like that you're probably not getting much sleep. You're probably tired. I mean, you're probably, you're probably getting to school and you're just falling asleep. And the teacher's over there tapping you on the shoulder and you're looking up and you're like, dude, you don't even know. Uh, trust me, I know. I know. I went in the class today and... Uh, had a perfect example for one of the questions the teacher asked and he said if anyone wanted to add on to it so I said yeah I'd like to add on to this 
before I know it, I'm talking for two minutes, and all of a sudden, I, I said, I'm going to be honest with you. The whole class is looking at me. I'm, so I'm going to be honest with you. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. <laughs> I mean, I was that taxed out, and uh, I mean, low of lows, like, I had to literally look down on the paper, reread the question, try to process it through my mind because I'm not getting enough sleep and that's not a good thing. I really promote you guys getting sleep, but five hours of sleep, you know, consistently a day, I think is enough. Um, just, just sleep, sleep, sleep quicker, sleep faster. You got to, uh, but five, six hours is perfect. To answer your question, man, I know you're grinding. I know you're putting in the work. You know, with whatever you're doing, you know how I love to promote whatever it is in life. I truly believe you put in 100% effort into it because you want to be the best. If you don't want to be the best, don't put 100% effort in it. I think that's useless. Uh, there's no point, you know. The reason I'm striving to put all my work into every single little aspect of life is because not only do I want to better myself, and just do the best that I can and know in 10 years from now that 2017 I kicked ass and like just accomplished all these goals but you know I'm just changing I mean it's just unbelievable but I'm wiring my brain I know this is going to sound so weird and you guys are going to be like watching this video and be telling me that I need some more sleep and I need this I need that that's true but I do want to say one thing I've been working every single week to wire my brain in a different way. And I know that sounds so weird. It is so easy to be negative. It's so easy to be negative. And that's what's taking over this world today is negativity. If you turn it around and wire your brain to think positive, and this is going to be so hard. I, I truly believe that this is one of those things where some people either got it or they don't. And if they don't got it, they're going to have to work on it. But bring positivity into your life, first of all. Think about everything positive. You know, I'm, le I'm laying on my deathbed, but I'm thinking about uh, if those fish are going to be biting good tomorrow. You know, just think positive. And that's hard. Because the easiest thing to sell is negativity. So easy, so easy. Um... So just think positive. That's my first thing. Think positive on everything. I apologize. My camera, uh, my card is actually running out of memory. I had to pause for a minute and get things going. To make this simple, Bryce, in Bryce's situation, why I'm talking about positivity, and it also hooks to dedication. It also hooks to determination. If you think positive, Bryce... If you seriously think so positive, like as you said, I, I feel your struggle and grind accomplish what you want. I wanted to ask you what you do on those sleepless nights when you have a lot of schoolwork and you to keep you up and going. Positivity, dude. I know that sounds so weird, but if you work on how your mind thinks about things, you can literally do anything. I'm telling you, you can do anything. And of course there's going to be a point in time where like you're wanting to collapse. I mean, you're just wanting to fall over. Like, I'm going to be honest, Saturday I had a big day and I was like falling asleep, standing up. Uh, literally, as I was just catching myself. Like, I don't know if you noticed in the last vlog, one of those clips where there was cameras at me. I mean, my face wasn't right and it just kept like falling. Like, I understand it. But think about the positive, think about the future of it and what, why you're working towards this. You know, like if I'm late, if I'm up late, if I'm pulling an all-nighter or it's like three in the morning, there's tons of times where I can say I could quit, but that's negative, man. You don't need negative, you don't need negativity in your life. And if you got negativity in your life, you need to kick it out, dude. You got to kick it out. But think about the positive. Dude, when you're doing that schoolwork, I mean, you're like, I'm doing this for a reason, you know? I'm going to grad school, you know? Or, why am I going home this weekend? Dude, I wanna go catch some fish. I wanna go have some fun. I wanna, like, relieve. I don't care if it's a two hour drive. Like, dude, think positive, man. Two hours fly by. When you get in the car, man, for those two hours, I don't know if you ride by yourself or not. Hopefully, you ride by yourself because I think it's a really great time to get mental focus.
play some motivational clips, dude. Do something with those two hours, you know, sit there and brainstorm. I know this is crazy. Get you a little notebook. Hold on. Get you a little notebook and write, write down stuff in it while you're driving. When, when it gets some traffic or something, start writing stuff down. You know? Like, start writing stuff down. What are you going to do tomorrow? That's another good thing. You, you get you a little notebook. Night before the day, dude, you're exhausted. You get you a little pen. All right. You write you down the date on top. Tomorrow is what? What's, what's today for the video? 10, 10, 17. First thing on my checklist. What's the first thing? Get shit done, first of all. Alright, tomorrow go to the gym. What else? Do homework. What else? Go fishing. Alright, wrote that down right there. Guess what? You see that stuff on paper? You're going to do it tomorrow. Like, you're going to do it. You're not going to not do it. You got to do it. Like, you're not going to sleep until that's done on the paper. That is just... That is straight grind to the grind. Like that is, that is called dedication right there. If you write something down and you were, you were gonna go do it the next day, start doing this. You guys that wanna get motivated, you guys that wanna work hard, go get you a little notebook. Night before, write you down, write what you're, write what you were going to do the next day on that sheet of paper on that, in that little notebook, write the date and everything, write every single little aspect that you're going to do. I don't care about a shower, man. I don't, I don't, of course you're going to take a shower. I don't care about brushing your teeth. I don't care about that. I'm going to the gym. You know, I'm doing my homework. I'm taking my quiz before 12 o'clock. You know, I'm waking up in the morning. I'm doing 500 push-ups. Um, what else? I'm cooking seven meals tomorrow. I'm meeting up with da da da. I got a phone call at this time. I got a meeting at this time. I go to class at this time. List continues. Get all the shit done and figure out. It's all about time management as well. And everyone tells me, dude, no, you need to focus on time management. It's not the fact of time management. I'm really doing that much. Like, I've been going. I woke up super early this morning, all right? I should have vlogged it. I woke up super early. I had class. Uh, I didn't go to class yet, though. I need to go get some stuff printed. So I went and got stuff printed, um, got all the files done, got some more work done for class, went to class, stayed there for about six hours, six and a half hours, drove from there home, it was about an hour and a half of traffic, started vlogging, went to the grocery store, spent 150 bucks on groceries, came back, started cooking, after I started cooking, went to the gym, and now I'm here doing this. Like, I haven't stopped. I haven't stopped, and guess what I'm doing after this clip? I'm editing. Once I edit, I'm going to make a thumbnail. Once I make a thumbnail, I'm going to upload to YouTube, put it on private, do all the tags. Like, that's what I'm doing. Like, do you think I have a choice? <laughs> like, dude, like, it's because I'm positive about it. Like, I don't even think twice about it. Like, yeah, it's 11 o'clock. Like, who cares? It's early. Like, dude, you're getting it done. Like, the past eight or nine months, I think it's been, I've uploaded three videos consistent a week. I haven't missed an upload. And in 12 hours, I'm gonna have an upload go out. And uh, you know, if I have to stay up those 12 hours to do it, then that's what's gonna happen. I'm not gonna have to, no. But uh, I do have some other things I got to do. But Bryce, to make this simple, man, who knows? You might be the most positive person on this earth. Like you might be just so positive. But man, I really believe if you start thinking just positive to the point, like if you're sitting there two in the morning, you're doing your homework. You have to do 30 thumbnails, all right? You have to do 30 thumbnails, and you're on nine, and you're getting to the point where you're about to tax out. I want you to just push everything away. I want you to sit down. You open your notebook. I have to get those 30 thumbnails down. Boom. It's done, dude. It's done. There's no one that's going to stop you. The only person that's going to stop you at that point is yourself. You gotta think positive about it, man. Cause that late at night, you're trying to get work done. You're exhausted, dude. Guess what? Think about what the future is for it. Why are you doing that? Like, why? Why are you going to school? 
Like, why? Ask yourself, like, why am I doing this? Then you say, oh, to get a degree. This degree is going to, like, change my life. You know, I'm going to get an awesome job. You know, be making a good bit of money. And uh, I'm going to live a great life. Dude. Positivity, dude. Positivity. I just want... Gosh, I just want... It's so hard to pump this information into people's brains because there's one thing is I'm pretty young. I'm only 20 years old and I've learned so much in the past year about training myself on to think differently about life and how things go. And I've just been living so great. Like life is just amazing. Like I just want you guys to know how lucky you are to even be on this earth. Like how lucky you are. Like one in a trillion chance that you were put on this earth and dude, you're here. Like you should be thankful for that. So since you're on this earth, make a difference, man. There ain't no point to go waste your time. Make a difference. Make everything happen. Keep grinding. Keep rolling. I don't care how old you are. I don't care if you're, care if you're 12 years old watching my video right now. That's even better. Let I me mean, start early. Just keep going. Stay positive, guys. Keep grinding. This was the longest rant I think I've ever done in a YouTube video, but I just think this video is so valuable. Like, this video is so valuable. Yes, I missed a Tackle Tuesday video today, but I uploaded this instead. And in my opinion, on how to throw a jerk bait versus this video right here, this video is worth a million dollars because no information you're not going to be able to learn information and process everything the right way if you don't train your head first like i just truly think and if you guys don't like these style of videos you can click off of them all right but i think honestly i think it's a dumb decision to click off this video if if this doesn't like just get in your head because it's so important and this is just should drive you drive you right through I want to make a difference, you know? I want to make a difference with you guys that are watching this video. I want all you guys to succeed. I'm already inspiring people in the fishing industry, and that is awesome. I've inspired people to fish. People that, you know, never fished before started watching my videos, and then they're starting to fish, and then who knows, they might end up being a pro one day. Because of me, I inspired them. Or, you know, Jim Bob over here inspired them. Or da da da, whoever inspired them. I don't only want to inspire you. I want you guys to make a difference. I want you guys to try your hardest grind every single day and make a difference in the world. Because 99.9% .9 of people won't make a difference in the world because they don't have dedication and they don't have grind in them. I just think it's so important. I just want you guys to take everything I said in this video and just put it in your brain. And if you skip through this video a little bit, I don't care if it was 15 seconds, go rewatch it. And now after this video, don't click, don't click on another one of my videos right now. Don't, once you finish this video, shut your computer off, shut your phone off. I don't care what it is and go do something productive. I don't want you to watch another one of my videos right now. Don't do it. You can watch another one of my videos in a few hours if that's what you want to do. Start today, start grinding. Keep the positivity through the roof. No one's going to stop you, man. No one's going to stop you. And Bryce, keep your head up, brother. I appreciate the comment. I think that's awesome, dude. Keep on doing what you're doing. And don't worry about, you know, supplementing this and that to keep you grinding, bro. I think the most powerful tool to keep you going on those hard times is in your head, dude. It's all in your head. It's all in your head. Just make sure you're eating healthy and uh, of course supplementing you know coffee like you said but dude keep that brain in the right area and think positive man i know it sounds insane but think positive and it's just gonna happen i promise you just tell yourself you're gonna do it and just go do it do this if you have to i do it just keep grinding guys thank you guys so much for the support this is probably a video you guys are just totally not expecting but I really read this comment yesterday and it literally gave me goosebumps 
And I know it's not that much of an, like, it's not really an inspirational comment, but I relate to it. Like, this kid is like, dude, I'm doing this, 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 and then driving every weekend. Like, dude, I know. Trust me, I know. I was sitting there doing homework when I read that. I saw it pop up on my phone, and I was like, tomorrow, I'm making a video over it. So that's what we're doing right now. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you guys so much for the support. Please share this video with your friends. Please share it because I want to get this message across to everyone and just make this world a better place and have just tons of grinders going after it and just killing it, just killing it. And just be the best that they can be, spreading positivity because there's too much negativity in this world. Way too much negativity. So let's spread positivity and make this world a better place. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Be sure to smash that thumbs button. Thumbs up button. Just smash it. Please just hit the thumbs up button. Just hit it. Comment below a goal that you want to accomplish. And also subscribe if you haven't already. Go kick butt tomorrow. Go kick butt right after this video. Right when you're done with this video. Go kick butt. I'll catch you guys in the next one. That's all I got to say. I think that 24-7 an understatement to my day-to-day. -day. If ain't no way, then I'ma make a way. Yeah. Nigga said, said, ain't no way.